Olga Munoz is from Argentina. She's a journalist and also the president of an association called FAMPAS, which defends life. Years ago, she met Cardinal Jorge Bergoglio soon after they started collaborating. I do a lot of work in the defense of life area, and Bergoglio always remembered the need for mercy, the need to help out the single mother and the pregnant woman. He would say, let's not accuse or point fingers, let's focus on mercy and help. She says that back in Argentina, the archbishop was very concerned about all the social abuses children were exposed to. So Bergoglio asked everyone to work together. Without any type of embarrassment, he told a group of foreign businessmen, I need your help. I walk around these streets and I see small poor children getting into these brand new cars. This is unacceptable. We need to do something. She would often run into Carno Bergoglio in the post office or even when using public transportation. One day I asked him, Monsignor, how are you doing? And he said, oh, everything's good, just working on some paperwork. One lady heard me, so she got out of her seat and said, please sit down, Monsignor. He said, no, 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 you must be a lot more tired than me. You have plenty to do at home, and now you're going to work. In addition to his humbleness, Munoz says she remembers Carno Bergoglio as a person who always wanted faith to grow upon a solid foundation. It's something that he highlighted during his first Mass with Cardinals, where he said that to be Christians, one must walk, build, construct, and confess.